Welcome back. Oh, oh, every day, girl. Michelle's <laughs> blah, 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 blah. <laughs> To be Michelle. Bo -bo 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 -bo. Our box has gotten even bigger. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You must get like all the time. I do. And people buy me think stuff. Sis. Sis. <laughs> sus. <laughs> hey yo, sus. Hey yo, sus. <laughs> hey yo, sus. Yeah. Sus. Yeah. You know. It's easy to shop for me though, because you just, if you see a snake thing. You just get a, I'm just gonna start sending you like live snakes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, it's a package from Detox. <laughs> <laughs> I think that would be fun. I'd be down. It's not, my sister and I always, like, anytime anyone crosses us, we're always like, we're just gonna release snakes in their houses. <laughs> Probably shouldn't be saying that while we're live on Facebook. <laughs> now people will know my secrets. <laughs> my sus secrets. Sus. Sus. Hey, yo, sus. Hey, yo, sus. It's like sut. It's gonna be huge. <laughs> I really think it's gonna be one of those things that catches on. <laughs> I'm sure it will after this. I'm down. I'm down to catch the sus. You heard it here first. Sus. I saw it on an Instagram video. I'll tell you what this yeah, yeah, video yeah. is about later. <laughs> <laughs> Just sissies doing sis things. It's very that. Were there, are there sis sisses? <laughs> are you still doing this too? How'd you do that? You were you on the step team? No, but I used to go to step team all the time because my one of my like little girlfriends in high school was on the step team, and I, I loved like, it. I could show you how to do. That was like. <laughs> 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 well, hello there. Oh my God! I forgot we had an audience. <laughs> my name's Alaska. What's yours? <laughs> Hi, uh, and we're, we're, the, the, who are you? Chad Michaels. Oh, no, no. Well, it's me, Detox. Hello. <laughs> Hi, honey. Hi, honey. How are you? It's flu season. Oh, my gosh, right. <laughs> you know what else season it is? It's All Stars it's 3. All Stars 3 season. Already, we're here. I'm ready for some more girls hanging in the hallway. I know. I'm, ex I'm just, I was gagged that it was coming so soon after. So quick. But I love it. Yeah. Like, I mean, I need more Drag Race all the time. The fans need more Drag Race all the time. Just keep, keep rolling it, it out. Just keep it coming, please. Por favor. <laughs> um, so the premiere's tonight. Yes. At 8 o'clock. Yes. 7 Central on Seven VH1. Central. Tune in. Yes. I will be tuning in. Yes. I just set my DVR today. I said record series. Mm-hmm. Do you do I'm first run or all runs? What does that mean? The first run is like just the, the just the like first initial premiere. All runs. So, all runs is then you get like, then you get loaded up with all the reruns and everything. I want them all. <laughs> I want them all. So I have a question for you. I and, have an answer. And we have answers as well because for you guys. if you have questions, type them below and we're gonna answer them in a little bit. So um. Mm -hmm. We see them right here on our little magic device. Mm -hmm. I don't but know if I can say or not, <laughs> because I don't know what the sponsorship deals are with that. I have a question for you. What's up? What do you love about All Stars that is different from regular season? Um, a, th a few things. I, I love the fact that we've already been introduced to the cast of characters. Like, we already know them, we know their strengths, we know their weaknesses, we get, we get to bond with them. Yeah. Um, so it's fun to, like, see somebody back, especially people who, like, from the earlier seasons who may have not gotten a shot to do as well and to have watched them progress throughout the years and now see them have an opportunity, that's really awesome. And it's also awesome to see just how catty everyone gets like the drama is there the drama is palpable yeah and i feel like especially with this cast it's gonna be there heavily it's already Saturday. it's already there in the first 15 minutes which we'll talk about in a little bit but mm -hmm. it's like straight out there straight like straight out the box it's like drama 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 but yeah. okay, so, but you did all stars I, not did I you i don't know i can't remember oh uh, yeah it's a crazy time of my life. Um, but, so your experience doing All Stars, how was it different than than doing season five and being like on a regular season? 
Honestly, I felt like season five, there was, I, I didn't have a chance of winning in my mind. Mm -hmm. I, I was like, there's no way, it's not gonna happen. Did you go into it thinking that though? Yes, I certainly did. Uh -huh. And so in that way, I think I just let loose and like had a good time. I was like, who knows how this is gonna go, but. You I, might as well make the money. I'm not gonna yeah. win, so I might as well like get naked and you know, <laughs> swing it around in the workroom. Why not? All Stars 2, on the other hand, was like, I was like, I was putting so much pressure on myself yeah. because I felt like, this is it. I have, this is my last my chance, shot. you know what I'm saying? Uh -huh. So I, you know, so I put a lot of pressure on myself. Yeah. All Stars 2. I mean, well, it's, it's, a, it's a lot more pressure going into an All Star situation because you do have to prove yourself. And, right. and, and then you're like hungrier for it even more so than the first because you like, you feel like you need to vindicate yourself. Yeah. That's how I mean, that's how I felt when totally. I went in there. And it is the last chance. There's no, there's no more. Right. You're not going back in the Thunderdome. Right. I mean, who knows? I mean, Maybe who, we are. I don't know. Wait, are you the 10th queen? <laughs> we'll see. <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> Tune in tonight, 8, 7 Central on VH1 and find out who the 10th queen is. Spoiler alert though, actually, I don't know who I'm... You haven't seen the first 15 minutes, you're late. Exactly. <laughs> the <laughs> and the other shade noise they love in that 15 is the... <laughs> it's like one of those little fish with the ridges on yeah. it. And you go, <laughs> It's literally a fish noise. A wooden fish noise is the new shade sound. Um, uh, to, I'm going to start paying attention to all the noises. The editing team here on Drag Race, let's, I mean, first of all. Emmy, Grammy, Oscar, Tony. All of it. All of them. <laughs> they're so good. I hate them at the same time, but they're so, they do <laughs> their job so well. What? Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. I have a... That's gonna drive me crazy. <laughs> I'm not neurotic anymore. I'm not neurotic anymore. I'm I've not let all that little what? stuff go. I'm not distracted by what is this? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> what were you saying? <laughs> uh, I want to get into these this first 15 minutes. Okay. 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 We get to see everybody's entrance into the workroom. Yes. This is always really fun. It's like your first, hi, I'm here, let's do it moment. Right. And especially coming into All Stars, it's like, this is who I am. This is who I am. Let me sh show up and show out. Yeah. And I love this look because it's the only look on Drag Race you're not judged on. Right. The, you're not getting critiqued for it. So mm -hmm. literally you, you can, can wear, wear... You can get away with murder. You can wear... And a, some of them did not. <laughs> no, not even manslaughter. Not even manslaughter. No. <laughs> who were your favorite looks from this walking into, walking into the work? Um, okay, well, I, I loved... Kennedy's, just because it was ridiculous and over the top and that, that hair, I almost said it and I stopped myself from saying what I'm not supposed to say here. <laughs> <laughs> that hair was insane. Um, I just wish that she would have put an eyelash on. Right. Now I feel like we're doing toot or boot it. But I'm well, always down to toot and boot. It's uh, a scroot. It's a, <laughs> a scroot. It's a soot. They think of a new phrase every, every episode. episode. It's a scroot. Root? Is this shmroot? No. We just, it's a root. I love. <laughs> I was rooting for you. I Tiffany. was rooting for you. It was a root. And now I'm not rooting for you. I like Trixie's a lot too, just because it's super yes. nostalgic. It's so Trixie and it's the skating in is always funny. I thought, I'm, I'm answering all the questions. I'm sorry. Go ahead. I thought Thorgy looked awesome. I loved her little, like, and the clown music was ridiculous. Again, editing what? team. No, 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 no. <laughs> She looked that they great. All great. And she looked comfortable and she looked her. She looked her. It's That's like, what I want to see when you're coming into All Stars. I want to see you looking like you yeah. and doing what you do. Yeah. And I thought, you know, Trixie nailed that. Thorgy nailed that. Um, Morgan looked great. Everyone yeah. looked great. Yeah. Milk looks great. I love that there was like a little homage to, to her Pinocchio. Yeah, I like references. Mm -hmm. So I never noticed that about but, you, um, that you were referential. Ben had the Ben. Why, how did I forget about Ben? She was wearing the same dress. Yeah. She did the exact same trajectory of the run in, mm -hmm. and she was wearing the dress that she won Miss Congeniality in, yeah. but it repurposed. I loved that. I, I would like when Morgan was saying, and Morgan's my girl, and I love her. But she was like, you know, let it go, let like let, let that in the past. That's how she got here. That's how we know her. You know what I mean? So yeah. I love a good nod to look. I was Miss Congeniality. I'm here back again in this competition. 
And even though I'm not as present as a, as a lot of the girls that are there, um, she's making her, her statement. Yeah. And I thought it was great. And I yeah. just adore Ben. Okay. That personality is infectious. Yes. Like a disease. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I have to say I love Gigi Devane's look because yeah. she looks Well, she made trash cohesive. look great. She made the trash look gorgeous. And I couldn't even tell, like, where do you get yellow trash bags? Cheech, can you, like, message me and let me know? Because I really liked what yeah. she did, and I wouldn't have known that that was... I didn't clock that it was trash bags at all until, yeah. until they zoomed in on it, and she mentioned that it was trash bags. Yeah. <laughs> so good for her. And that dented yellow hat would not stay that on. That poor hat. She should have got rid of that hat. But <laughs> other than that, she looked great. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. So, the, the, and this is on the card. I didn't, okay. We have to discuss who we didn't like out of the entrance looks. That's hard. Hmm. The, one of the only moments that made us go like, mm, was the Kennedy eyelash gate. The eyelash gate, yeah. And I wonder if something happened because Honestly, you're sitting in that outfit for hours and for hours. For a long time before you even go in. Yeah. And it looked like, I mean, if like, I mean, not to be nitpicky, but also to be nitpicky. It looked it's like there was, we have to be we nitpicky. Have to. It looked like there was a lash there because there was like a little line of yeah. like her natural skin tone underneath yeah. the black liner. So it looked to me like maybe the, her eye was water. I've had this happen to me all the time where my eye is just incessantly water yeah. and an eyelash will not stay on to save my life. Yeah. So I'm wondering if that's what happened there. Maybe I she think had all that happened. stuff glued on her, and the glue can always like irritate your eye area and make your eyes water. And I'm give, gonna give her a pass, but I would have liked to see the lash. Yeah, and I would have liked to see the gown a little longer because she had those big shoes on. I wanted to touch the floor. Right, nitpicking. What, right, because it's all stars. Yeah, and that's the thing. There are no duds. Yeah, every. I wish I couldn't have seen Morgan's panty too, and her because she had that sheer dress. You and, can see her pants. Yeah, and they like they pan down and then they pan up, and the only thing that I noticed from that beautiful dress was her panty. Sorry, okay. girl. Okay, all right. Things to look for, the details, the screen grabs, screen grabs, <laughs> details. Don't worry, I'll take them. I'll screen grab everything later today and tag you all <laughs> on Instagram. I want to zoom in on that pants. <laughs> <laughs> You gotta zoom and then screen grab and zoom again because you know how sometimes you can't. You gotta get all into the green areas. That's what we like to do. I would like to talk about the level of shade happening already. Already. All right. Milk, now let me. <laughs> Milk, you're being a little shady. And I don't know you to be a shady person, but you're coming across maybe it's editing, who knows? But you don't have to blame it all the time, but you're coming across a little. Right, like I, a little, I, a little I mean, snarky, a little bitchy, a little, right, a little um, heady, right, grand. Little Would grand. you say grand? You know, it's my favorite thing to say grand. Would you say She's grand? Seen grand. <laughs> She's seen and yes, grand. congratulations on all of your successes, and and booking all of these amazing modeling gigs as a man. <laughs> the shade is out the gate, <laughs> straight. Well, you can't, like, I mean, that's, right. it's, honestly, it's an amazing feat. Um, and it's, like, I, I was actually just texting with her the other day, like, how proud of her I am. Yeah. But, you know, if you're, if you're going to reference that as to why you're better than everybody, you're referencing yourself out of drag. Like, you're here in a drag competition. Right. So just because you've been very successful and lucky in a male modeling career doesn't mean that you're necessarily a better drag queen than the rest of the girls that are there. Right. Which I think she's phenomenal. Yeah, but, she is. You know, let a little bit of that air out of your head. Girl, I know, and that's the thing, like, she's, I know her in real life, and like, she's lovely. She's lovely, she's that's why I was like watching, and I'm like. Hilarious, and, but, you know, every season, we need, we need that yeah. tension and that kind of rubbing up against, so like, she's providing it mm -hmm. early on. I mean, that's another thing too, is, you know, when you're thrown into a competition like this, and it's high stress, and everyone wants the end results to be in their favor. Yeah. People, not necessarily change, but, you know, the competition gets gets to people. Yeah. And they become a little more cunning and... and that and would never happen to me. <laughs> never. <laughs> Still waiting on that $10,000. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Check your PayPal. Turn on PayPal notifications. Um, who else? Someone else was being really shady, too. Who was it? I don't know. Oh, um, Trixie's kind of shady. Trixie's being a little shady. She's like... She's like... Um, She's like, uh, 
uh, Chi Chi Devane was wearing garbage. And Again. yellow and trash yellow bags. Trash bags. Yeah. <laughs> But her reads I mean, are really funny. I mean, the reads are funny. The shade is fun. I mean, obviously, yeah. it's a drag competition. There's going to be shade, but, you know. First episode, 15 minutes in. It's you guys already are already, so can I say bad. asshole? <laughs> well. <laughs> so I just, I, just <laughs> I can't say the F word, but I can say that you're being holes. <laughs> I'm going to try to edit myself as much as I possibly can. This is very difficult. What is one of the drama moments, like, of all time, Drag Race? Of all time? Of I mean, to me, it's like you can't really get better than go back to Party City where you belong. It was epic. You can't. It's like, and then they dressed up like an angel and a devil and lip synced against each other. Right. Like, it's like the forces of evil and good clashing. Right. And they were both still safe, though, because that's when they And sings. then Willem and then, comes and out and, and throws comes up, throws up and, up and goes home. goes home, right. <laughs> That's one of the, I mean, you Leave know. it to Willem to interject himself into, like, one of the biggest. <laughs> right, of course, there she is, of course. <laughs> yeah, I think, I mean, I, don't, I mean, that inspired that whole challenge that we did in season five. I think that particular fight, that moment, right. was, like, the pivotal one where it was like, oh, well, we need to have all of these, like, all of these other fight moments. I mean, the first real one that you see is between Morgan and Mystique Summers Madison, and that was because that was the that first was season of, of Untucked. That was, was like, deep. Fix your face at from Chicago. Okay, so what you need to do is right. you need to go fix, <laughs> fix your mug. mug. Fix your <laughs> so, fix something else. I fix know. your mug. I don't need to fix my mug. <laughs> yes, you actually do need sitting, to fix your mug. As Morgan's sitting there with the hairline like this. <laughs> <laughs> Shredded wheat. Fix your hair. Fix, fix your, your hair. hair. Fix your She's got like a one of those <laughs> <laughs> good outside sweep and brooms. <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Those Home Depot broom wig lines. <laughs> it was a long time ago. It was a long time Technology ago. Technology was different. I know. Lace wasn't really a thing. It then. wasn't. <laughs> what about, I mean, yeah, I think those are. Those are really those iconic. Are really good ones. We live for the drama. Yeah. And the truth is, no matter how, how crazy it gets in there, we're all still like friends after it's over. We're like, girl, do you remember that time yeah. I punched you in the face? That was <laughs> hilarious. Well, it's, I mean, that's what it's always so funny. Like whenever I'm on like Twitter or Instagram, and people are so like, people are so committed and so like, oh yeah, part of the the whole experience that we have, and they're so angry about so many things. But it, I sit back and laugh because it's like, we're all friends. We've all yeah. anytime that we've had real issues, which we've, I don't think any of us have had any real issues. No. We, you know, it's easy to move past it, and we're here to support each other. And now I'm here to support the, the girls of season three of All Stars, and also criticize them every week on Twitter. Hallelujah. <laughs> Screw. Schmoot. 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 Boost. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Who are you rooting for? Michelle Visage. I think she's gonna come out on top. I think she's. I think she's the tenth queen. I think this is her year. I think it is too. It's about I really time. Do. <laughs> she's like the Susan Lucci of Drag Race. She is. No. <laughs> she's like, let me show you how it's done. I uh, I don't really know who I'm rooting for yet. It's hard because I I love them all so much and they all have so many different things to bring to the table. Yeah. Um. So I don't know. It'll be interesting. I'm very interested to see who the tenth queen is too because oh maybe that God. might throw off my. My thought process. I know. I'm kind of rooting for Shamsa. I mean, how could you not? I love the the storyline of the coming back and uh -huh. not winning. The coming back again, not, not winning. winning. The coming back again is it gonna be this time. <laughs> I love a comeback, and I love her. Like she's infectious. You like can't you stop cannot. Her. Right. If I do not want to hear Hallelujah a single more time in my life, but Holly anytime Lou. I see her and hang out with her, it's so much fun. Hallelujah. <laughs> Hollywood. She's just, uh, she's awesome and so much fun. And I love her little, her entrance look was so cute and it was she like, looks she looked amazing. Yeah. She looked great. Keep it Do up. Do you think she packs that box in a suitcase? I, don't, I mean, <laughs> it, yeah, it's, it's collapsible. She travels with it. She everywhere. travels with it everywhere. It's her carry on. It's her carry on. Yeah. It is. They just put it in the, the little closet and first. Yeah. Even exactly. though she's in economy comfort. <laughs> she. <laughs> Let's play a game. I like games. You wanna play? You wanna play a game? Yes. This is a game where 
you read me. Suck and blow? A, well, maybe afterwards. Okay. Maybe afterwards. We'll do that on OnlyFans. Oh! Um, <laughs> the Drag Race OnlyFans uh, account. Why is that not a thing yet? It's coming. With it's coming. No, all they have to do is hit you up on Grinder and they get it for free. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. Uh, uh. Coming to a town near you. Then they put it right on Tumblr. Uh -huh. That's the thing. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, so what, what's gonna happen is we're gonna okay. read a quote from some someone on this first episode, and then the other person has to guess who they think said it. Okay. You go first. I'll go first. Let's okay, try okay. This is This is really hard, okay. Um, quote. Can we all agree that if one of us lets another borrow their gross rhinestone tank top, that we won't save them? Oh, I just realized that that was Plucked. <laughs> the, um, uh, who, says, who said it? Who would say such a thing? I think that's a Trixie Mattel. It's very funny. It's well crafted. Is it Trixie Mattel? It's milk. Oh, it's milk. Milk Alina throwing shade. Throwing shade through the, through the ether. <laughs> God bless her. God bless. Okay, I'm gonna give you one. Okay. This time around, I'm gonna prove that I can handle anything that's thrown at me without getting rattled by it. Thorgy. Um, close. How is that close? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> like, how can you be close? It's like either the person or not. Um, no, it's not that person, it's not that person. Do you want another guess? Uh, Tell me again what it was. She, um, this time around, I'm going to prove that I can handle anything that's thrown at me without getting rattled by it. Ben de la Creme? Oh my gosh, you got it right! Okay. Yeah. Ding! Well, I got, the second time I got it right. <laughs> right. right, yeah, exactly. That's usually how it works for me. Oh uh, my god. Okay, you give me one. Okay. Mm. <laughs> You'll get that right away. You're a low rent Michelle Visage. That wasn't the quote, though. Um, ah, you're just <laughs> telling me. You're just letting me know. <laughs> that is the quote. Oh, uh, that's the quote? Uh-huh. You're a low rent, Michelle. How can you get lower rent than Michelle Visage, though, is my real question. <laughs> She's Love an Airbnb. You, Mom. <laughs> the rent is... Right. Um, uh, who would say such a thing? I think that's Morgan. Morgan would say something like that. No? I don't know, I guess. Um, Aja? No. Who? Three strikes are out. It's Shangela! <gasps> oh! The shade, the is, shade deep. is deep with Shangi. And Michelle. abiding. Well, you know what? She's, this is her third time here. I'd be pissed at the judges, too. Yeah. <laughs> Go get her, girl. <laughs> Go get, get her, Get sus. her, Jade. Get her, Jade. Get her, Jade. <laughs> get her good. <laughs> okay, okay. Do you have any okay. more quotes? Okay, okay. This is fine. I like this. Do one more. Okay. We should make this a drinking game, though. Okay. I'm down. I'm just gonna send the bitch home that I think Morgan. is the strongest. Morgan! <laughs> Detox is dominating this game. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's a Morgan. Okay, let's Do you want to give me one more? Yeah. Okay. Hmm, I feel like these are both very easy, but we'll Good. Forget. I need a point. Okay. The only thing more annoying than Shangela is Bob the Drag Queen. Thorgy Thor. Yes. <laughs> Do you want another one? Sure. Okay. Lightning round. <laughs> this was Pearl Spot, and she skated by, so I'm looking to inherit that energy. Trixie Mattel. Yeah, there you go. I was like, think about it. The clue's right there, sis. She loves skating references. Loves skating skating references. by, skating mm -hmm. through, skating into the workroom. Skating work into room. the workroom. Yeah. That was fun. You was are the really undisputed fun. winner. I guess so. Finally. <laughs> Don't forget to be sending in your questions, because we're going to be answering some questions in just a few moments. Let's take them. Let's should take we? some questions. Should we take some questions? Look at now? these. They're pouring Oh, wow, in. they are. This is crazy. It's okay, so okay. Nice. Let's go up to the top. Okay, okay. Oh, that that was the sample. That's not <laughs> real. That's not real. Okay. Okay. Oh, this is, is a good one. this is a good one. GJ asks, 
Detox in Alaska. Do you think anybody will rival your iconic All Stars 2 raps this season? In no season. No season ever. <laughs> Past or future mm -hmm. of any show. Um, um, it's hard to it's hard to stand up to that. It's a, I mean it's pretty epic. Yeah. <clears throat> Even like when we first heard it, we were like, this is gonna be really great. Fire. Yeah. It, yes. It was amazing. So yeah. we'll I mean we'll see. I don't know what the challenges are gonna be like this this season. So. Yeah. So who knows? But I mean, clearly they loved it and they brought it back for season nine. I know you love me, baby. That's why That's you brought, why me, you brought here. me here. The truth <laughs> is, there will be nothing to rival Roxy's verse. Right. In the history of or music. her history of music. Lauren and Hill who? <laughs> Lauren who? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's going to be really hard. I And they did it on um, season nine. They did, right? yeah. And I thought those were really great. Gender is a construct, tear it apart. Mm -hmm. Wearable art, terrible art. <laughs> <laughs> what else do we have in here? This is a good one. That one? Okay. Roy asks, who was your favorite guest judge of all time? Roy, is that Bianca? I don't know. <laughs> hey, Bianca. Hey, Yonka. Hey, Yonks. <laughs> <laughs> who was your favorite guest judge of all time? I'll tell you who wasn't, LaToya Jackson. <laughs> Let me tell you why. Tell us why. Because she read me beneath the dirt, into the afterlife, into the great hereafter. <laughs> she said I looked I like don't a remember sad bridesmaid. Said. Like, it's stuff that didn't even make it to air. It was like, you don't have to say this. You're just choosing to, like, eviscerate my existence. LaToya. So I would love to have another chance to, like, impress LaToya with a purple satin um, bridesmaid's gown. <laughs> so who knows? Oh, I do remember that one now. I love Bob Mackie. Yeah, I Bob Mackie was great. How incredible to meet such an iconic person in the world of drag. Mm -hmm. Like, he is drag. Yeah, he was incredible. Yeah. I loved the Pointer Sisters. Oh my god, yeah. I loved the Pointer Sisters. I love that Joan Van Ark was there. Remember, like, I lost my mind in the workroom and Rue was like, Joan Van Ark, and she was like, Detox is the only one who knows who that is. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, yeah. Oh I, was like, yeah. <laughs> I was like, let me get my shoulder pads out. I got this one. Wait, what show was she, was she on? Not she was on Not Slanting or, or, or Dynasty. I don't know. No, I feel like she's on Not Slanting. Yeah. I don't know. I can't remember she's now. Beautiful. She's beautiful. She's really sweet. Yeah, and she loved that lip gloss. Every time they would cut to her, she would just be like <laughs> piling lip gloss on. I remember that. Oh, and I guess. I mean, I mean, I have to get into, of course, Lady Gaga was a guest. Oh, like judge. period of all time I mean, for all the episodes, not even yeah, our seasons? I, I mean, oh, God. For, for me, that's a huge moment because she was like, she was coming in not as like, I'm like casually observing and entertained by this crazy stuff you're doing. Mm -hmm. It's like she actually was coming from a perspective of like, I do drag. Right. Too. Right. And I have my whole career. Mm -hmm. And so she was really knowledgeable, and I thought Yeah, she was I great. actually really, really enjoyed her her presence there and the way that she spent the time with the girls. And, like, I thought that was a really awesome experience for them. And and someone who is such a fan of our art and what we do yeah. was great for her mm -hmm. because she's always been so supportive to the drag community and to, the, and to RuPaul's Drag Race and to all of us, honestly. Yeah. I wonder if they'll get, like, Cher and Madonna and... No, die. yeah, die. you'd live. There was a rumor going on, and I text, I text everyone in the like, world. What's wonder. I was like, going on? Ah, no one's yeah. told me that my mom was gonna be on set. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see. Well, Cody asks, why are we so fabulous? We were born we're this just, way. We're just breathing, honey. It's all it is. Yeah. <laughs> Sharon asks, would you be up for being on the judges panel in the future? Hi, Sharon. <laughs> Sharon. We're sure uh, it's probably not that. Hey Sharon, girl, hey girl. It is Sharon. I've been envisioning <laughs> Sharon needles at home. Just a, with the cat. And the with cigarette. the cat sipping, <laughs> sipping coffee. Um, would you be up for being on the judges panel? Absolutely. I want to tear everyone apart. Yes. <laughs> I think that's our honestly our biggest goal. <laughs> yeah. And just so I can do this move, which is my favorite, and you're sitting there, and oh, all the girls are on stage, and it's. <laughs> <laughs> That one. 
<laughs> you make eye contact, make eye contact, with, contact with them. They and literally they do this. 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 <laughs> <laughs> they literally do this. Like Michelle and Rue, tell me what you're saying behind that folder when you and hold it up. And then you're up there like this. Tell me. Your feet and then you are bleeding. Rue, and then you catch Rue do that's one of these. <laughs> and it's, that's when you lose your mind. You're like, well, I'm going home. I'm gonna, right, I'm that's gonna it. Pack my stuff now. It's over. <laughs> That's the whole reason. Alexandra, she wants to know which queens are you wanting to see lip sync against each other this season? Oh my oh lord. God. A Kennedy and Shishi Devane showdown would be amazing. To see them both jump off the stage and into, into a the split. split at the same time would be. I life feel like altering. I envision it right now them both spinning around, jumping up into a split, and then. Lifting their back legs up to touch each other's toes. It's like I could, it's like synchronized dragging, and I'm all about that. Literally. And yeah, they're amazing. I would love to see that showdown. Oh my gosh. Who else? I mean, there's there's some pretty good lip syncers out there on this cast. Really good. I mean, Shangela. Like, Shangela. Don't try it. Don't try Morgan it. Morgan is an amazing lip syncer. Oh my god, she's an assassin. Yeah. Yeah. Morgan V. Shangela. Ooh, that would be fun. The season two girls all together. I would tune in. Let's see here. <clears throat> Do we have time for Do one more? Do we have more? A time for one more? Let's make it a good one. That one or that one. Send kisses to Brazil. Oi, amiga. Muito obrigada. Um. We already answered that one. Okay. Um, who oh, wait, we have another one coming in here. Oh. And you could <laughs> call your baby detox. So, okay, the right, the question is Summer Settle. My wife and I are having a baby. Any good name ideas? Detox. That name? Yes. <laughs> I christen, I christen you Detox, Detox Wilson. <laughs> or Cornanda Detox Cobb. Elizabeth. Call your little baby Cornanda Cobb. That would be a really cute. Cornanda Cobb? Cornanda Cobb is the middle name. <laughs> Cornanda is the first name, Cobb. And that way you can be like, this is my little Cornanda Cobb. And then you always dress the baby in yellow. I love that. And that way the baby's gender, you know, you don't have to like give the baby a gender identity at an early age. That's it. And your since, baby's corn. And since we said it here on Facebook Live, if I don't legally, see like you eight have to do it. Babies named Cornanda Cobb by the end of the year, I'm gonna quit drag. You <laughs> had a promise. I'm like, I'm like, please don't call your babies Cornanda. I want a break. <laughs> Cornanda. Cornanda. I think that's it for our questions though, yeah? Yes. Thank you all. So Thank you much. all for asking those beautiful questions. Thank you. Spending time with us. This is this is so much fun, and and I think the day that um, RuPaul's Drag Race premieres is, is always like Christmas to me. It and is. It's always really fun. I get so excited, and I'm glad we got to do this together I in know. commemoration. It's going to be on tonight on VH1, eight o'clock, seven central, seven C. And make sure you guys let us all know what you think about tonight's episode. Mm -hmm. Blow up Twitter, blow up Instagram. We're looking yeah. forward to all your comments. And and after the show, if you watch the pit stop, I'm going to be the new host. Of the pit stop. <gasps> oh, she's got gigs. Yeah, oh. I'm so excited. So we'll be talking about the episode, um, and that's going to come out after the episode. Awesome, amazing. Well, thank you for being here with thank me. Thank you for being here. <laughs> Goodbye, Cornanda. Oh, bye, Cornanda Cobb. <laughs> Make sure bye. you send us pictures of Cornanda. Bye. Send us pics of Cornanda now. Bye. Bye, Brazil. Bye.